guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Sonia and you're watching Domestic Diva Diva IY. Today I'm going to be creating two rustic pumpkins for my front porch decor and I will be using some of these uh, uh, boards. Uh, they are like barn boards, uh, reclaimed wood type of boards and we will also need some sort of um, decoration for to tie around the stem drill a sander and a saw and a pencil so this video is also part of a look for less challenge hosted by latina next door and her co-host for this month is yelena from the blondie next door i will have both of their channels linked down below so make sure you go check them out because they are awesome diyers you're going to get tons of inspiration if you are not following them already and like i said this is a challenge so there will be a playlist which will be linked down below so uh, for the look for the way to look for less challenge works is we're supposed to find an inspiration that's um, expensive maybe out of our budget or simply we don't want to spend that kind of money and think that we can make it for a lot less so my inspiration is from Etsy and it is $98 and five cents um, and I uh, absolutely love it however um, I do not wish to spend that kind of money myself I had to run inside because um, the rain came for like two seconds and there's planes going by and there's people doing roofs so everything that could go wrong is kind of going wrong but I hope you can hear me nevertheless so I'm just trying to figure out my pieces here trying to see which one's gonna go where okay so I'm going to just mark off where I want certain pieces cut and I know that I can't necessarily do it in a circle myself but I'm going to cut them on an angle and then uh, sand the rest of the stuff so I'm going to cut these pieces so I'm going to do it on a 45 and then just straight cut for that one so 45 and straight cut for the bottom one at the stars but now it feels just like I wandered off into a room and closed the door behind me I never gave the key to you even though I wanted to there and I'm going to mark it off again just for sanding so I know how I'm going to do this and I'm going to cut this one as well so for sanding I'm using 100 I think that's what the number is because this one is 220 yeah. and I'm probably gonna finish with the 220 actually I'm thinking I might cut off these these ends as well just to make it easier for cutting sometimes i just don't know what to do it should have been you so now i'm going to sand these a little bit as well your place but now the crown is shaking could be a face but it feels like it will never go away until we make and i'm going to also round up the edges on the bottom but I have a feeling I'm gonna give them a little cut too. I think I can trim off this one a little bit more. I think that looks pretty good. Now I'm going to assemble my bigger ones. Uh, I mean, cut them. I could be 
wrapped around your arms instead of peace. Okay, same idea. I think I cut, a, cut up the wrong piece, but anyways, I'm just going to cut that there. Okay, so here is my bigger one. I'll sand the edges again. Sometimes I just don't know what to do. It should have been you. Okay. There we go. Now I'm going to find a piece of wood that I can attach these with. Okay, so I'm going to just secure them here. With a couple screws. Sturdy. And now I'm going to assemble these. So here they are and apparently my neighborhood is the most happening place to be today. There's music, there's pe music on two different na neighbors are playing music. It's Tuesday afternoon. Yeah, so I had found these in my yard so I just cut them and I'm going to use them as stems and I'm just going to attach them with some hot glue. So I didn't have a wrap yet to wrap around, well not long enough to do it. So I decided to still go ahead and just add some of these leaves around. Uh, but I will have to use hot glue for them. You have a little bit of raffia, just not long enough, so I'm thinking I might just add to it. So here they are, all finished. I love the way they turned out. I think they're pretty close to the inspiration piece and they cost me zero dollars because the wood came from a friend for free thank you friend and the rest of the stuff I had on hand or in my garden and I'm pretty sure that you could easily make these out of um, pallet boards without a problem and usually you can find those for free so I want to thank Yami and Yelena for hosting this challenge and uh, make sure like I said check out both of their channels 
and the playlist after you're done watching my video and if this is your first time stopping by my channel i would love it if you press that subscribe button and a notification bell so you don't miss out any of my upcoming fall and christmas diys there is going to be ton coming your way those of you returning thank you so much and until next time hope you guys have a wonderful day and thank you for watching